what is going on guys and welcome back to Detecto Gaming and um, today we're going to be doing something a little different we're going to be playing some uh, Star Citizen I'm going to be showing you a bit of a uh, Port Alisar which is a uh, first port that is able to travel to Star Citizen so yeah so it's the one we started out with and it was a lot of the ones that um, we pretty much we called home. Travel there, and this is some we we basically want them to, and sort of like uh, sort of like hyperspace, but we're you know we're still in. Um, so. Quantum travel is still in the, um, you know, while we're still in the uh, star system, and I'll show you the star system right now. So this is where we are, around the gas giant planet Crusader, and this port Alisar, and then you have the moons Damar, Yela, and Selen. I'll just be showing you uh, port Alisar today. Then uh, later I'll show you the moons, and then later on I'll show you a uh, Crusader. Got a contact. Please proceed to sign landing bank. All right. You gotta contact the um. Landing people. As you can see, somebody's uh, flying in right there. That's another person. Looks like a Sekiro. Game Sekiro, but actual person. So this this guy is a little heavy to fly. She, I should say. So we'll put our landing gear down, and we sort of just uh, maneuver it and uh, fit it in there. Just, just. You know, you can do it the best. Sort of cheat and put it this way. You now, everybody has a different way of doing it. Um, so. um, just do it the best way you can. Sort of start Warning. from the note. You are blocking an active flight bay. Please. Sometimes that happens. You know, we. Um, and not sure if I mean I'm pretty sure though sometimes uh, this game will be a bit buggy and it won't let you it. but there's Crusader they've um so they've sort of redone the artwork for it and um, since you can't actually fly into the planet now um because it's a gas giant you can't land on it except there's uh orison which is a landing zone for it that is the place i wanted to um that you know we were supposed to dock at I think. So this is where so we came out through there and then this is where we're going. This is the way to this is the airlock to go into the station. So it's pretty neat, I think. So I'll show you guys from different viewpoints say. This is my character and And then you can sort of walk around. Um, it's really neat. You can just walk around. So move your mouse around, and you know use the W A S C T E keys. And then, of course, you have to go into first person, check everything out. But um, 
Yeah, so they have benches up here, and then over here, this is where you um, have to check out and uh, store or retrieve any of the ships you'd like to use. And you can also claim them. You can do that, which is really neat. Um, here's a spot where you can do some trading, and you can see what they sell. Um, so, say if I go to this one ship, Crusader Mercury Star Runner, and then I can pick up some of this stuff, I can see how much it's worth, and where I can sell some stuff if I, say, had it on one of my ships. I don't currently have anything, but you can, um, you know, you can buy stuff, and then, you know, that'll actually be loaded onto your ship. And then you can sell it at another, uh, at, like, another location in the star system. They have NPCs walking around, which is cool. Uh, so this uh, cassava outlet, it's a clothing outlet, it's pretty cool. You can also get water there, um, which you need to eat and drink in this game, otherwise you would uh, die. Eventually. They do sell clothing, so they have uh, footwear, gloves, hats, pants, shirts, jackets. Uh, not much to see here, but um, nice you, you know they keep improving on a lot. This is where you can uh, pay your uh, fines and citations. up here. So up here is the easy hab which is basically for now it's the respawn point and so players who enter the game like when they load into the game they'll um they'll come out out of uh, one of these rooms and um which I think is really neat. So they're pretty much let's see if I can I think not the one, but they're pretty much like hotel rooms, uh, or motel rooms. And really small and um you know they're they've just got a bunk bed and a place to store uh, food or armor or helmet. Which is pretty cool. Basically like a space hotel. Let's keep moving. There are more uh, landing pads up there, and then let's see over here. So, uh, but and then Dumpers Depot. I think this is where this is where you can get uh, ship equipment like that. Uh, yeah, so that's really cool. So you can buy uh, shield generators for your ship, other things. And so there's... Does that from time to time. And then, this is a really small uh, space station, space hotel. So, last but not least, see, look, you can see um, planet from right out here, which is really nice, really nice view, I love it. And from other planets, say Daymar and other moons of uh, Crusader, you know, you can see the, um, you know, you can see the, um, um, you can see, I was going to say Jupiter, but you can see Crusader um, from that, which is really nice. Got all the um, armor under suits here to wear. Let's 
said the my mouse from So this is where you can pick up all your armor, uh, undersuits. So the essential, I'd say, helmets, pretty cool stuff. Um, takes so like that. Yeah, that's and then, last but not least, we have the. Uh, Weapons over here. So we have, we have these uh, meals all ready to go. Then we have other stuff over here. We have guns, other types of stuff. Then we have, you know, the, the screen that you use. Uh, so medipens, so for like if you have a horrible. Um, yeah, that's pretty much um, what I wanted to show you today, so until next time, uh, take care, and uh, welcome to Star Citizen. I'll be coming out with a lot more content for Star Citizen for sure. Um, definitely in the near future. Um, I'm trying to make it daily content, if not daily, then uh, every other day, but um, until next time, just peace.